Alrighty, after many much rushing around, I think I've got everything. With ominous music, that's always a good thing. Hades first, good morning, how are you doing? Me? No, I'm doing okay. Other than sleeping a little late and then rushing to get the stream going. That's neither here nor there. I'm just surprised we had power. But we should use this opportunity to experience a new game. Alright, just fiddle with settings. And make sure everybody's here. Just knife on. Alright, let's go with something a bit more cheerful. Uh Yeah. A bit more cheerful. Doom type music. I know, I know, my definition of cheerful is uh, broad. Overly cheerful, however, is a bit much. Well, remember, I'm still early in my first coffee, Hades first. How are you doing? Did I ask? Yeah, oh, well, I have the power, not necessarily the touch. But well, I touched the light and they went on, so sure. Now, there was supposed to be shand, uh, shand, and outages this morning. We had them last night for four hours, and we we're going to have them again this morning for four hours. And there's a bitch to play your life around that sort of thing. But sometimes they do it, sometimes they don't. But you can't plan as if they're not going to do it. So, in the streams, somebody was talking about the Lone Dark and wanting to see me play it. So, I was looking at it on Steam yesterday. Thinking, ah, that's not that expensive. It's an oldish game. It should run on my computer. And then I was reading the reviews, as one does when looking at a new game. Just to get a feel for the game. And it turns out that it was free on Epic Games during December. My thought was, eh, that's interesting. I don't remember it. Oh, look, I own it already. So I downloaded it, decided we'll give it a go this morning. Well, only, I've only started it up and played it for like five seconds, just to make sure it ran on my PC. Other than that, haven't played it, haven't seen any videos of it. I haven't seen any playthroughs of it. I'll give you my honest opinion. I love this warning scene of do not attempt anything you're about to do in the real life. It's an interesting warning sign. How many kids or people had to try and do this for them to put that warning sign up? I like that this was made by like the the Canada Tourist Association. I thought it was awesome. If you want to advertise your your tundra of death, what better to do than the survival game? Its audio volume is that way too loud. is off as always could very well be but maybe they don't want you wrestling in the snow okay we got some for those of you new I don't play in-game music. I've been bitten with that one too many times, so we've got our faithful companion, however cheerful and entertaining, humble bundle, royalty-free, random playlist playing in the background. It might ruin the ambiance of the game, but it might make it entertaining as well. 
There is cheerful music, there is scary music, there is ambient music, there is all sorts, and it is on shuffle. So whatever it chooses is what we're listening to. Like the music currently playing is actually from the Humble Bundle, I think. Yep. Can go with a bit more. Uh, yeah. So I will react with the, the music in the background being inappropriate and all of that. I'll point it out when it is or isn't. It is part of the experience. But I am glad that you all could join me this morning. So how are you doing this morning, Darth Griff? Or afternoon or evening, or whatever it may have speed for you. Okay, okay, I think we're ready. Ready. Need to turn the that on. Complicated thing. Dream software, are you picking up the game? Answer is no, no, it's not. There we go. Nice, days off are always pleasant. All right, so I just want to display. Do we have full screen windowed? The answer is no. Okay. And not a problem. So if I'm alt tabbing out, it's to deal with something on my other screen. We we can live with that. We've got winter mute, which is the playthrough mode and survival mode. I think we're gonna go with winter mute. We're gonna start a new one, episode one. Click the right buttons. What did I just do there? Oh. I just selected the easiest difficulty. Thanks, Rich Ankle. I mean, it's also 5 o'clock in the morning for me, so I'm still waking up. Voice is still warming up. So it should change as the stream goes on. Jennifer? Nope. First time. I got recommended it because I was playing Stranded Deep, and I happened to have it. Just never played it. Got given it free on the Epic Games thing. So we are going to experience it for the first time. I'm going to experience it for the first time and people are going to laugh at me. And new game. Episode 1. Not. Yes, capable survivor. Not green, not hardened. Capable. I think that's a normal difficulty. And we'll go with just plain old normal difficulty. We're going to call this... Um, Playing with myself and self. Yeah, I have it happening. There's no background music. Come on! Stupid playlist. Inconsistent with volume. Inconsistent. And then we get a loud one to blow your drums up. Good. You know, good. Is that are we? My voice isn't overpowered by the background, but it is still available. There we go. Right, I think we're ready. So last night, one of the things that uh, no, I'm just starting to dragon. How are you doing? Just about to go into the game. First playthrough. I played for about five minutes last night just to make sure it was running on my PC and all of that. As one does. And then I was like, well, let me... Oh, look. It's a budget Wolverine. That's a joke I came up with last night. Okay, it's not a budget Wolverine anymore. I tend to try to clear up anything that can eat me. But we shall fumble this together. 
This is why I called it fumbling the game. Well, fumbling along. It's a learning experience. You think of this. We're going to go with lower background music. I'm going to go with louder. Master volume, sound, and voice. Joker. Okay. Seems about right. Ambiance. This space seems like a bit much. Just fiddling so that it's not too much into the stream. People hear me. I'll go with 40%. Chat wanted me or recommended it to me, so we were going to give it a swirl. I think that's a bit better. Feels like another record cold snap on the way. That I sounds a bit more than, than a cold snap. This is going to be especially funny, seeing as I live in a country that doesn't have snow. Just historically, it's not a thing that I've ever dealt with. But we're going to use Gamer Logic, Bear Grolls, and MacGyver to empower us to do anything that we're supposed to do. Hmm. Great Bear Island. Dad used to fly there all the time. He said it used to be beautiful. Not much reason to go there these days, since the quakes and all. You say there's not much reason to go to the jung uh, forest because of the earthquakes. Still waking up, so you're gonna have to forgive me. Never had to deal with hypothermia. Heat stroke, sure. Hypothermia, not so much. So I saw the, the icons at the bottom yesterday when I had a quick squib. So we got food, it looks like, water, uh, visibility, and then coldness. Which makes sense in snow. You want maximum visibility and you want maximum warmth. One thing I did notice is that I'm, when I walk around indoors, I get the sound of snow. Oh, that was funny. Can you hear that? Snow. Must be snowing pretty hard if it's making the wooden sound or the wooden floorboard sound like snow. In a glass, warm, maybe with a bit of sugar in it, in my hand. That, that, that's the choice of coffee for me. Other than that, it would be just be instant coffee. I'm not a coffee snob. I'm a coffee addict. There's a very big difference. Hmm. Compressor. I suppose I could, but I don't have legs. So I don't know how I'm making walking sounds anyway. Oh, that sounds like crunching snow. Gamer rule one, gamer logic. If it ain't nailed down, steal it. I don't remember needing my parka this early in the season. If it is nailed down, look for a crowbar and steal it. Red Jackal, I actually can't stand tea. I really don't like tea. He says, oh, look. E in a game. I mean, I'll drink it if I have to. Damn, that's right. But uh, it's not tea. Again. This has got a crunch to it. That could be very possible. Yet again, no legs. I'm Casper, the friendly survivor man.
secret hatch. Search hatch. Search hatch. Oh. One thing I did notice which annoyed me, and it shouldn't actually annoy me, is that there's a sprint. And that's fine. But there's no jump. This game doesn't have a jump. Because I kept pressing space to, like, jump around. To see stuff. And there's no jump. And I cannot explain why it is so well, annoying. Not annoying, are, just off-putting. Your best flights may be behind you, but you're still beautiful to me. And anyways, you're all I've got. I'd sure love to give you one last great adventure. Oh, those are very, very, very ominous. That That's like asking for, for trouble. No, actually, I'd go so far as to say that's demanding trouble. Requires hacksaw to break down. Uh, we got a workbench. Do we have a hacksaw? Got a wood saw. We've got, I'm guessing that's a pair of pipe pliers. Or pipe grips. And we've got spanner. Nope. No hacksaw. How curious. Oh, we've got lockers. Cheers. I know there's a lot of reasons why you shouldn't be able to jump. I just like jumping in games. It's something that we always do. Well, I always do. Pretty late in the day. I guess I could take a nap. Oh, it's my background music. I thought, why is there a Doom song playing? But it's a thing from my playlist. Okay, let's turn the playlist off. We play, we we're going with ambiance. We're a lone survivor. Oh. Can I get up there? See, this is why I want to jump. I want to get up there. And I want to experience this hangar in its full glory. Got some pallets. That's going to make some firewood from that. Got another door. I haven't opened that one. Got a bed. Hangers. I'm going to just put this in my pocket. It should make surviving easy. Okay, sleepies. Who could that be? Jack Rabbit Remote Transport, Mackenzie speaking. I told her not to come up. I told her you couldn't fly in this weather. It is a very sad Whoa. bedroom. Well, slow down, Maureen. What are you talking about? She just showed up. Said you'd see her. Said you'd fly her north. I know you need the money. The weather service... It's okay, Maureen. I've got it from here. What fortuitous timing. Uh... We were just talking about you. Hello, Will. Seriously? What are you doing here? Turned music down. I don't need sappy music in my life. It's been a while. Especially I know. not this early in the coffee. Yeah. Years. Oh, I haven't heard from you. Me. Since. I know. I know. And I wouldn't be here if it weren't important. Well. What brings you. I have a super secret saying? mission to go on. And you <laughs> no, are the only person no, to save me. us. But I need to get to someone who is. Right. So you're still a doctor. Okay, we can do captions. <laughs> still a doctor. Eh. I thought that after. Once I can actually access the menu, we'll Why put are you captions here? on. I need your help. I need your There's help. There's an isolated community in the northern part of Great Bear. Someone there is very sick. Great and Bear. There's nothing there anymore. Not since. I know. But I. I don't even think I can uh, skip the cutscene. Still trying to save the world, huh? And that is irksome. To Somebody me. has to. What's that supposed to be? Even more Mackenzie. irksome than not even being able to jump. Will. I didn't come here to fight about the past. I need a pilot to take me somewhere remote. Someone who won't ask too many questions. 
Someone I can trust. Wait, questions. Astrid, are you in trouble? Are you gonna help me or not? Yes, he does look. What's in the case? Possibly See, got some frostbite happening no on his nose. Remember? What's in the case, Astrid? No questions. She looks grouchy. Look, the weather out there is bad. Bad. I mean, it's getting worse. You walk in here after years. I could have been dead. You could have been. And then you show up and you want me to just risk my life flying into the middle of the great northern nowhere to deliver you and some mystery metal case to some remote wilderness outpost. Okay, All because it's a you walked in here. Avenger. We need to save the world. Yes. It's unique. You can't bring him back. This isn't about that. I know how hard it's been. No. You don't know, Mackenzie. You don't know anything. You don't think I feel like well, I know how to fly, which is why you're here. Not? The longer I wait, the worse it'll get. Damn it. Look, I don't have time for this. Wait. The worse what will get? Why do I have a feeling you're not talking about the weather? <laughs> Basically. Because I'm not... Throw your bags in the plane. I'll get started on pre-flight. I'm sorry, Better but this plane has been sitting be here for flight. however long. I don't know, what, weeks, months? I don't know. But you can't just start up a plane that's been sitting. You can't start up a vehicle that's just been sitting for a while. You need to do actual proper mechanical maintenance, check fuel lines and that Two sort of stuff. And that's not it, even when you're in... The middle of nowhere in a snowstorm. Almost no capacity for cargo. If we're too heavy, we'll burn through our fuel before we get there. I'll have to be careful about what else I take with me. Oh, oh, uh, lots of red flags are going up. We've got like a team of cheerleaders with just red flags swinging them around. Duct tape? Do we have duct tape? We wanted captions on. Oh, uh, Okay, so we want empty, want that a bit lower. Master volume up, sound can stay there. Disability, B. Display. Hey, where I find it? Subtitles. There we go. Ominous red flags and why we shouldn't take them. The PSA. And just a, a note, we're at 10 current viewers, so we're in the top 1%, boys and girls, ladies and men. How does it feel? You're part of one of the top 1% streams. I know, to me, feels exactly the same as when we had 9, but it makes a difference. Nice, Lucas. Okay, I think I've pretty much stowed in everything I can. Oh, wait. I would. I would. It's going to take me a while to get used to the control scheme. It's a bit weird. I keep hitting E to interact with things. Hammer. I definitely want a hammer. I want that saw. I'll take it. Game, you're not helping me. Box. Can't jump in it. The mysterious case. Leave it. Astrid definitely doesn't want to talk <laughs> Go all that way and just leave it behind just to screw with her. Probably the distress pistol kit is heavy. Take it. I'd hate to end up in a First aid kit. Take it. It's not nailed down. We're taking it. Uh, probably best to add some extra meds just in case. Okay. We'll call it hoarding then. We're hoarding everything. But but gamer logic still holds that if it's not nailed down, you take fine and fine. Traveling pretty light. Whatever, okay. Wherever she's going, she hatch. Must not be planning to stay long. Yeah, you can put her. Oh, why would I put her stuff there? I'll leave it on me.
So when I was looking at the other reviews, there was one that was quite funny. Because on the, the Steam page, there's all about like this lone survival and difficulty and all that, which is all great. But one of the, the popular um, reviews says, it's a great game, but I wish it had multiplayer. My thought was, it kind of defeats the point of a, a solo survival with multiplayer. And then keep the nails. That's what you want. Okay, so guessing I'm gonna have to put her crap in. No, hold mouse button. Uh, and her. Huh? Just need to grab my parka and we can go. Oh dear, dear, dear. So let's see what we got. We got a straight jacket. That looks like a straight jacket. Is it only me? Did they make that look like a straight jacket? We got some tea. We got some boots. We got first aid kit. Survival kit. Sock shoes. Okay, I'm guessing this little star here is uh, survivability or durability. Okay. Okay, yeah, so fair enough, fair enough. Got underwear, that's. Thermals, yeah, that's good. A bunch of stats. Anyway. Don't need to get too far into the rules, because me. Where's the fun in that? Can we just go now? Can I play game? What am I supposed to be doing? Well, I'm no pilot. Extra Parker. I'm no pilot, but I think that you need arms to hands at least to fly this picture does second my thoughts I see you're still wearing it. A, a straight jacket would, would possibly hinder would make it a definitely and more entertaining flight Our rank. Oh. Yeah. I, mean, uh, I just forgot to take it off It's too small and I can't get it off. Not all of it. Need to get it surgically removed. Look. I, I should have looked for you. It's okay. I've kept busy. I've moved on. You sure? Because this all seems pretty familiar. You still working with that researcher? I'm not working at the center anymore. Well, then where? I'm working on my own. I wish you got the thing that I threw in the cargo bay at the back. Freelance doctor. Did you go in after I put it away in the safe place and take it out to hold it? So, as to make the scene more dramatic. Drinking in the daytime. Hey, we had a lot of good times at this point, and it's under control. I know. Okay. I'm not here to fight. Oh, I'm not not here to fight, really. That means you're not not here to fight. Just that it isn't your primary task. I know you do. But I did. The choice I made. I did it for us. But you don't have to. Let's just not. No. It's important that you hear this. There's things I need to Mackenzie, say. Mackenzie, not now. There's. Let me tell you. Will, shut up for a second. Something's wrong. Oh, oh, that was the plot that just What's hit. I don't think there are controls wow. on the planet, Captain, that can bypass the plot. Shit. Ooh, she said a bad word. Maybe that's why they're crashing. Will? Yes, yes, they did. Okay, so we were flying peacefully, having an argument, and we drove into the plot. Seems reasonable. I like it. Not too deep, not too light. You're invested. Now I want to run around with sticks and stab stuff. Or, you know, not die. 
this may either me be a, a decent attempt or not. Here's our budget Wolverine again. Just by the by, because there's no first contact today, I, I decided I'm going to have an extended stream. So you guys are more than welcome to stay. Dude, if you went through the windshield, you'd be dead. Oh, okay. He, he hit the plot a second time. Oh, yeah. What are you? Gotta stop that blood loss. Yes. Okay. As soon as I figure out the controls, I had. Really? I had a full medical aid kit. On. I'm pretty sure we're gonna use it over there. Okay. What do we have? We got a strained ankle, a sprained wrist, pain. Oh, that's descriptive. We're numb. We're wounded. We're dry mouthed. And we're peckish. Oh, it's got a cannabis counter. That's pretty cool. Hmm. Then we can select each of the. Okay. Uh, temperature is bad. We're um, dying, so I should probably play the game and not talk. Uh, play Apparently, the plot armor is not thermal insulated, so we're gonna have to build a fire. Oh, matches. Hey, okay. can I just stand here? Art. Character. Oh, what am I doing? Character. There we go. Oh, burns. My bad. It was too close. How can I be burning to death? Be standing next to a burning plane. Or am I missing something here? That hurts so much. Good morning, dragons. We're doing good. We're dying of hypothermia, and I just burnt myself. It's not good. For... Okay, one chill. We can with that I'm pretty sure that this is all kidding me I got enough paper and crap we've got a nook all right how do I make a fire craft craft fire make fire go Is it? Wood. Fire, make, go. Ooh, we're missing something there. Yeah. Drop. Drop, drop. Okay. I think I'm missing something. How do you start a fire? Ah, we use the tab says fire starting. Uh, that makes sense. We just click a button for fire starting. Drop, 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 and uh, and then use. Oh wait, I've got the radio man one. The radio menu. Let's see what the radio the not jump button. Fire. 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 There. Oh fire. Sorry, I, I play games mostly that don't have radio member uh menu, so 
Better take me a little while to get used to it. Come on. It just proves that this dude's so awesome he can make fire that's so better than um need to rest up. You know, burning fuel on the ground. Okay. But well, we also picked up a cool drink. And we're probably gonna need to drink that. Drink it. Okay. Yeah, that's a good start. Our temperature is... Yeah, yeah, okay. Death is not quite imminent. Pretty sure we can put the, the matches away. H. There we go. Okay. We're doing a stick. Break that down. So if we have a bit of material and a stick, we should be able to make a splint. Okay, I'm sorry I burnt you. Can we stop hopping on about this? I know it sucks. Okay, so we got cloth, we got books. Tons of stuff to burn. Claimed wood. Or cloth. So we should be able to, with sticks and cloth, make a makeshift splint. This is just a wild guess. Depending on the game, you can either make a makeshift splint or a parachute. I'm guessing this is going to be more of a, a splint type of fire. Really? I've been playing for like five minutes and I'm lost. Oh, oh no. Put the fire there. Seriously, I just... just uh, Okay, we've got a cave. Cave is good. Cave is actually very good. I'm not going to have so much wooden chill here. We can get another fire, which is the radial mem menu. Doesn't mean I've wasted a bit of resources. But this should be a way better place. Got a fire. Well, uh, I'm pretty sure death isn't going to have to wait that long for me. Okay. So... What have we got? Night sources. Yeah. We're not looking good. I think I burnt myself too much. That's not good. Don't have any first aid. Those are doing okay. We got no food. We have a recycled can. Craft, crafting. Bandage. Okay, so we'll make bandages. Two bandages. Two bandages. Two. Game craft. Add fuel. Okay. Eh, uh, back. Oh! Damn, fire. Oh, fire. Add fuel. How do I add fuel? Okay, well, I went out. Listen, learned. Fire's hungrier than a B rate feature in a creature feature movie. So, I'm guessing I got inventory, I go to fire, I go to mood. Or radio member? Ah, there we go. Uh, add fuel. Uh, fuel. Okay, so it's going to last for an hour and 18 minutes. Fire log. Three hours, okay. And the reclaimed wood gives us four hours of 
Oh, that's a lot. We have a bandage, I think. After the bandage, we use the bandage, we use the bandage, the right hand. Use the bandage on um, the left hand. So I've damaged both my hands. Gonna make surviving easier. And I'm gonna use it on right foot. And I'm gonna use it on pain slash all. Just a, a general pain. Okay, so uh, how are we doing? How are we doing? Let's see, character, persons. We have got <laughs> burns on both hands. It's my bad. We've got decent temperature. We don't have anything to cure burns with. Pain, the one painkiller. Don't got none. Okay. Uh, gonna wait for my core temperature to raise a bit, and then we're gonna rush out and see what else we can do. As long as I don't lose the damned cave. I figured. Okay, so we just need painkillers. Which sounds like a good idea when you're in the middle of the tundra. I had tea on my inventory. Didn't I? Or does that not matter because it all reset? Apparently it doesn't matter. Or temperature's doing well. E. Path. Fire. I think I've got plenty of wood. That's good. Can't pick up. Oh, I can't. Okay. Just need to get close enough to it. Okay. I shall do that shortly. My feet. Oh, I got bad news for you, dude. When I checked earlier, they were missing. We're just levitating above the ground. Okay, we're in my little cave. Gonna add a bit more fuel to the fire. Yeah. Fuel. Gonna add the sticks. And wood. Dialogue. Okay, so we've got six hours. Got a bunch of books. Right. I'm mainly looking for about eight hours so that we can sleep for eight hours. And we've got a bunch of stuff in the inventory. As soon as I figure out how to sleep, we shall do so. Radio member? If we're struggling to find, figure out how to sleep, then uh, I'm not having a high hope for the rest of the game. Is there a button I push? Oh, okay. 
didn't even see that. Right. So we had a nice roaring fire going, so our body temperature shouldn't have dropped, but our hunger and thirst. Astrid hasn't come looking for me. Which means she can't come looking for me. Because she's hurt. Or worse. Maybe she just doesn't like you, dude. I'd better get back up to the crash site. I mean, I know you did crash her into the tundra in the middle of nowhere, but maybe she just doesn't like you. Okay, I need to do something. But first, we need to scrunch up some food. Water. Can I use the can? Yeah, I want to use the can. Can. Want the can. 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 Use. Uh, Take it. And to use the can. I'm gonna scoop up snow with the can and just use that as water on the fire. Yet. Make sure there's enough. Enough. Oh, jumping. You. Oh, it's got one minute. That's not very good. Yeah. Mini match fire going. So we've got snow and fire, but couldn't that make water? Or am I thinking about this wrong? Am I in the wrong mindset? We've got a can to scoop up snow. We've got a fire to melt the snow and purify it. That's water. Oh, okay. And we got few. Okay. Water tank. Okay. Yeah. That'll be nothing in there. Or is there a water tab here? Patient. Campsite. Oh, okay, okay, we can do that. I love it how me walking around sounds like a it's not subtle. Just the clinking and clanking. Just shoving crap into our pockets. Fire. Water. Ooh, recycled can. Effect. Melt snow. Okay. Yeah, I was at least on the, the, the right thought process. 18 minutes. Okay. Just exploring while I'm waiting for the water. I'm going to take a wild guess and keeping the fire going is like step one in surviving this game. In a multi step process. Climb to the ravine. Yeah, I wasn't expecting much in the first try. I think that bone on my hands really didn't help me. Definitely rip aggro.
17 mi- oh. Can I use bones as a weapon? And... Okay, so I'm gonna have to use these. The staggering up a tree trunk while uh, dying makes perfect sense. Probably gonna have to stop picking up stupid stuff. Probably climb that. The pain. Uh, but nothing to help you with that, dude. Which are good. But uh while we're complaining about pain, it's you know, rack our hands even more climbing up a barbed plant. It looks like it might have food. Can you have eat trees? You need to eat a tree, what do you eat? I guess I can make tea with this and it would be painkiller. Or I can eat them. And it would be something. I need some water. Okay. Yes. Some water. Get that. I understand your 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 concerns about, you know, dying. Though we've got like 17 minutes. Okay, so I'm probably going to sneak up over that way, up there, wherever. So. I'm guessing I just combine this with the hot water and I'll get tea. Items in the inventory can be co collect the correct item. One that. Oh. Am I missing something here? Do I need to take the can into my inventory? Let's drink water first, then make some tea. Or, yeah, not. I would have just staggering further and further away from the fire. Okay, thirst is sorted. Book tab on the fire. We keep stunning me. Oh, I don't have any. I need to pick up the can. Can. We can. Campfire, cuke. Oh, we don't have. Seriously. Give me. Want to cook? Get up. Pick up. Cook. Can. Select. No items in inventory can be cooked with selected item. So I can't put the row stuff. Okay, so I need to wait for 18 minutes to put it to boil. Okay. Uh -huh. uh, boil water. Cook. Gonna take me. Oh. 
computer, do what I want, not what my fingers are telling you to do. Hook and collect and water. We want boiled water. Cook. Take nine minutes, and we're probably not going to survive. But my other thought was we're carrying a ton of stuff on us, which is probably weighing us down. All the firewood. So if we drop this, it should make life a touch easier. less strain on the body if we're going with pure realism and you know putting the wood near the fire makes sense yeah I've got 24 how many do we need okay so we're pretty much not going anywhere Is this, I'm guessing, it's in-game minutes. Five, four, okay, it is in-game minutes. Three. Still just trying to understand the mechanics. We'll get there. I mean, this dude has to suffer in pain until then, but eh, sacrifices need to be made. Okay, standing in fire, not good. The pain. Yes, yes, we were working on the pain. We got burns again. It feels like it's still burning. Um, but we need to make crafting bandage. We're going to begin crafting the prepared rose leaf thingies, which I'm guessing is important, and a bandage. Oh, that hurts so much. All right, we're going to then use the bandage on my dumbass for burning myself on the right hand. Okay. Oh, don't jump into the fire. Use the fire. Hook. Hook. Eat cook. You with me? Water. Oh. I'm doing something wrong here. Hey, Bannon, how you doing? Murder. But there was potable water in the thing. Whatever. Um, I'm doing well, thank you. I missed right there. I figured you meant me. I've seen many misspellings of the uh, the name. How are you doing, Bannon? Banana? 
still early in the coffee. Okay. Step one, potable water. non-potable water take your time just take your time it's fine if i make the fire hot will it cook faster that's an interesting question we don't have anything Okay, this is going to be cutting it close. I am not holding my breath in that I survive. Especially since this dude has almost stumbled into the fire a couple times. And I really don't need help stumbling into the fire. I can do that perfectly well all by myself. I do remember vaguely but um don't take that as an insult it should i remember the name i just don't remember from where so we got pot potable uh, potable water book okay. ah no water Okay, so we're going to do this again, because we're really not going to survive. Next time, I'll plan on not burning myself, so that is uh, something. We'll grab the medicine. Okay, I've got potable water. All good, banana. You're more than welcome to chat. If I see it, I'll respond. If not, then I won't. It's not like the, the chat makes a noise and it'll distract me. No worry, banana. It's nothing to be sorry about. It's just... A game. I was very much dying already. Aha! Got it. Probably too late, though.
All good. Oh. I had some potable water in my inventory from when I picked it up. How he was holding water in his inventory with no container is a mystery. It's those pockets, I think. Do not go into that good night. Tumbling around like a drunk, that's what he's doing. Which I suppose is fair. Come on, come on. Oh, no, that's not what I wanted. Drink it, drink it. So, magic pockets. I guess we've got no health, no food. That's good. Boil some more water. Still stumbling around quite badly. <laughs> That's funny. You can make a fortune just generating glass bottles. Oh, regen, regen some health. Still uh, not doing particularly great, but... Got the can. Water. Melt snow. Cook. What do we have in our inventory? Uh, got water. Got tons of water. Bandage. Okay, what do we? Okay, so we've got no afflictions. We just need food. That's good. Okay. This seems like a bad idea. Yep. It definitely falls into bad idea territory. <laughs> Sprint's not working, strangely enough. I'm guessing if I go to sleep again, it's probably going to kill me. How much time do we have left in the fire? Mm. Fuel, we've got 52 minutes. We've got no fuel. That's good. Okay. Uh, you need... Can and this is all round bad idea. We've got no firewood because I threw it all in there because I was expecting to die. Not 
food. We've got some water though. That's good. Climb up there. I agree, dude. I feel your pain, but... Yeah. Do not go gentle into that. Make it. <laughs> you just jinxed yourself, dude. Seriously? We're bleeding to death. We can barely walk in a straight line, but hey, he's optimistic. So, uh, that's good. Yeah. More roses. Thank you. Thank you. Finally made it. <laughs> oh, why, why are you climbing down? I didn't tell you to climb down. I was just waiting for him to kill over the edge. Just after he said we finally made it. Just like die of starvation and fall off the edge there. That would be a cinematic moment. And instead he decides to waste more energy and climb off the edge. Makes sense. Night, dragon. I hope you sleep well, and I'll speak to you later. Hobble our way to that direction. Hey, we can hobble at a sprint. That's not going to be bad for us at all. I'm guessing Slain. Not sure which of us looks worse. Poor girl. This isn't how things were supposed to end. That, where that? Right. Uh, that. Looking for you. Okay, so we got the parker on as well, so that should help with the hold. But obviously not. Back. We're surrounded by rocks. I'm sure we can make a plan. It is an emergency. In this case, Astrid was ready to die for it. I hope she hasn't already died. Ooh, food. And mittens. And antibiotics. Very good. We need a radio menu. We need oh, radio man for that. What do we need? We don't need antibiotics. We don't need that. We need food. This bar, eat that. Okay. Can't feel my hands. Um, why don't you put the mittens on? We do have mittens. There you go.
isn't there a thing on the plane the cargo hold thingy the back there does it, that, that not count anymore okay okay I get it I get it we're dying we're dying I know and you you radar you radio member fire start fire yeah and go possibly want to start a fire while not standing in it but you know yeah each to their own really at the end of the day Oh, good, good, good. Mm. Probably a good thing that didn't work because I was standing in it. One man, one goal. Damn it. Staggering into the fire. All I can think about is food. That's great. Okay, our first death, I am going to go with of many. Okay, right. Uh, I think we'll start from the beginning and hopefully this time we don't burn ourselves. I didn't quite mean to start from this far in the beginning. Basic gaming. Feel everything. Yes, dude. Skip. Seems about right. Good morning, afternoon, or evening, like Tanfuck. How are you doing? I'd better get a fire going before the pipe springs up again. Let me play the game and I'll do it. Basically, it doesn't matter what I I'd steal before the plane does the thing. I don't get it after I crash. He said it used to be beautiful. Not much reason to go there these days. I can live that wood stove, start fire, blah blah, start fire. Cool. I'm prepared for the first five minutes of the game. And we died, so it's a learning experience. This time we're gonna try and not burn both my hands. And that'll probably be a good start. Door. 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 Oh, 
fantastic. Plane. I don't remember needing my parka this early in the season. Yeah. No. Here we yep. are, old girl. Your best oh, wife good. may be behind you. It's but still beautiful to me. Chat's already been giving me hints. Anyways, you're all I've got. I'd sure love to give you one last great adventure. Uh, I would appreciate if you just like wait and see me struggle a bit. I know that might be hard and possibly entertaining. What was I supposed to do? Memories. Want a nap? Yeah? Want a nap? Okay. Yeah, so if you can just let me have a, a good or a little bit of a try, but if you see me struggling, I'm not gonna oppose. Help. Yeah, that's right. I just rose up again. Huh? Uh, okay. Missed something. This plane, hatch, Arca. when you need it there we go getting pretty late in the day guess you could take a nap oh all good jennifer all good not a problem who could that be it is a group effort and i know how frustrating it is to watch somebody fumble around in a game that you know the answer to Normalize the sound. <laughs> it's my ears. Transport, Mackenzie speaking. I told her not to come up. I told her you couldn't fly in this weather. But what if we clean up so damn well, long? Don't scream at me again. What are you talking about? Okay, we can skip. Let's see. Two people plus enough fuel to get us out to Great Bear. Struggle makes for a great story, yes. Hmm. Almost no. And if you can struggle in an entertaining way, that means you make a great streamer. Too heavy, we'll, burn so we'll see how well that does. To be careful about what else I take with me. Oh, yeah. The mysterious like that. Been traveling yeah. for the Astrid's a doctor, yeah. so we're covered there. Water. Yeah. The scratch pistol kit is heavy, but I'd hate to end up in an emergency yeah. situation. Ditch. Arca. And go to the plan. You. Shoot there and. Need to grab my parka and we can go. Yep. Yep. We've listened to that before. Definitely for the algorithm, Jackal. Yep. I figured the fire was going to be my most important must have gone right through the asset. Trees broke my fall. Oh, mostly. But plot armor saved you. So, okay. Up, oh, don't burn myself this time. Need a bandage. No, we can do that in the morning. I want to save as much health as possible. I didn't mean to do that. Have you? Okay, no, don't want to do that now. We'll do that later. Nope. Okay, cave. Wood, wood, wood. Craft a campfire. Campfire. 
Uh, I got a pretty good chance. Oh, good dragon. Damaging hands is never fun. I don't feel so good. I need to rest up. Well, yeah, but first we need to make sure that this lasts. Oh, I don't do that. Need to click on it. Need to add fuel. And okay, it's four hours. Craft a bandage. Two bandages. And we're off to a better start this time. Mainly because we haven't burnt ourselves. And it's never a good start. Left hand. We use it on. Trained ankle. Okay. I think we're good. What else do we have? Strained wrist. We use. Bandage on the wrist. Okay. Need to rest up. First, I want some more fuel. Punch. Oh, great. Grab some more fuel so that we can do this whole sleeping thing. Not worry about the fire going out. Hey. Okay. Yeah. You go. Oh. As good as I can do. Let's go. Snap. hasn't come looking for me which means she can't come looking for me yep yep okay because she's hurt or worse could have put a can on the thing before i went to sleep for water but up to the crash live site. learn all that stuff but we can make our way up to the plane in the meantime grab the yeah, rose stuff. later matches and a cool drink and we're gonna drink a cool drink good times good times but deep pockets deep deep pockets wood I could probably climb that yep Oh, 
Oh, not climb. Okay, climb. You're gonna climb back up. Because that's where we need to go. It's not like we're in a hurry or anything. Yeah, yeah. Okay, you. 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 Oh, I think this is the start of a trend. Me clicking too fast. Not waiting for the targeting box to come up. Okay. I think I'm gonna make it. Well, let's not get overly optimistic. This is the attempt number two. So you were wrong the last time. I didn't do it that time. See, I learn. See, that's not ominous. sure which of us looks worse poor girl this isn't how things were supposed to end Astrid's back hmm. yep walked miss Yep. Whatever's in this case, Astrid was ready to die for it. I hope she hasn't already died for it. And then we just need to find the Parker again. Here. Suda. I've been looking for you. Hey, eh. look at me. I, I used the radio mem radial menu without fumbling. Watch. Learning. Idle. Not any boxes around. Okay, we're cold. Gotcha. Cold, cold. Shouldn't have done that. That, that was a mistake. But on the flip side, we did get some new socks. Oh. That's something at least. She definitely passed through here. We're in a hurry. Uh, she did just survive a plane crash, so... Is 
Couldn't find uh, um, lighter food this time. I was about to make a fire. I was just remembered I didn't pick up a fire lighter. There. Excellent. You start a fire, you don't have to worry about that. I mean, you're only freezing to death. Why is this a difficult thing? Come on. It worked. And I did sleep, didn't I? Earlier, do I need to do it again? into the fire. Shit, that burns. Okay, yes. Falling into a fire burns. Gotcha. The pain. Yes. And he fall, fell into the fire again. Okay. Um... Where's the last checkpoint? I'm guessing the last checkpoint is where I started. We'll go with the last checkpoint. I can skip all the cutscenes and stuff. All right, lessons learned. Instantly build the fire. Instantly. Just I've been looking for you. Yep, you, you, food. Go over here. I better look for signs of Astrid. Yep, yep. Gotcha. There must gotcha. be signs of Astrid around here somewhere. Uh, yep. You're repeating yourself. Build a fire. Hey. Thank goodness for that. So what we can do this time around, to be a bit more smart about this, is cook water. While that cooks, we'll go get some Oh we got it. Not 
raiding stuff. Need to add more fuel to the fire. I better look for signs of Astrid. Getting there. Fuel. We've got 55 minutes. That's a mistake. And uh, more sticks. At least I'm not staggering around like a drunk on a Friday. Alright. Bags. Yes, Yeah, I got that the first two times. Whatever's in this case, Astrid was ready to die for it. I hope she hasn't already died for it. Yep, yep, gotcha. Park we go. I pick up the Parker. I think. Parker. And not seeing anything else particularly interesting. Stand next to our fire. Get our rose water going so we can heal up. Not fall in the fire. I think that's a big second there. Stuff, do them. Back, no fire, add fuel. Add. There we go. Oh, I had few, four hours of fuel there. I think it put it, auto put it on. Same as the mittens, it put it on automatically. We got mittens, we got the parker. Missing our second hat. Everything else. More importantly, get out. Okay. Good. Eat. Water. Drink. Water. Drink. Yeah, I figured. Layers. It's all about layers. Okay, let's get more water. Time. Box down. First box. So if we go to character again, got two pairs of socks on. Parker seems to have better stats.
must have been a pinball to fly out of that window, go around that curb, off the end of the cliff, and land on the snow outside over there. Must have just bounced off all these walls. She definitely passed through here. Need to hurry. I don't like that tip they just gave me. To be quite honest. The dashing you can use to get away from dangerous stuff. Wandering around at night in the snow in the middle of nowhere, probably not the bestest idea, but... <laughs> if we can find a cave or something, that'll make our lives easier. Twigs. Three. Oh, goody. Really? Really? It was barely... Supposed to tuck and roll, go with the jump. Let's radio menu. Oh. Okay. Oh. This might take more than two. <laughs> the amount of effort he puts into that is just amusing to me. Radio menu. Love the little footprints. That's pretty cool. Okay, that was a shank. Bugsy got away. Definitely probably gonna need more ammo. And possibly a fire. I will the fire and hope that the rab just runs into it and cooks itself.
Throw a stone at the damn thing. Okay. Hunting. Be very, we very quiet. Go after that one. Come here, Robert. Come here, Robert. Come here, Robert. Go grab it. Gotcha. Right in the noggin. <clears throat> Stunned, but not finished. Noted. It was a shank of a shot anyway. Really? The, the hitboxes on these things are quite small. And that's my excuse, and I'm sticking to it. There we are. Come here, rabbit. Come here, rabbit. Yes. Good rabbit. Good rabbit. Seriously. Okay. I'm just doomed. How do you shank a shot from there? No one give me the land. You know, at that distance, I could have just equipped a stick and just hit it. Someone's been here recently. Gotcha, you little bastard. Ah, you bastard. Uh, Okay, my aim's improving. That's good. My memory, not so much. Working on it, dude.
First you gotta hit them. That that's that's the tricky part. This one. This one's I feel it. This one's gonna run straight into my mouth. Yeah. Bastard. Or not. My fingers feel numb. I'm just trying to get my aim in a bit. So it's in line with my thumb. Is the general answer to the question. Don't throw the stones. Pick them up. That doesn't sound like a storm heading in. As with all things, sneaky, sneaky. Here, Bugsy, Bugsy. Here, Bugsy. I got a carrot for you. No, Miss Carrots. Second. <laughs> hey, fine. Go start a fire. No worries, I just remember that my water and stuff is on the other fire. So I should probably... Do the whole get that thing. I'm gonna pause quickly, I'm going to go get another cup of coffee. That definitely help with my aim. And I'll be right back in a couple minutes. Click these couple buttons. I'll leave you with the soothing sounds of the random playlist from Humble Bundle Music Pack thing. Right, so I'll be back in a couple minutes.
I am back. Thank you, Adam. I am glad that you appreciate it. That you enjoy the game. Thank you very much. It is appreciated. Oh, yeah. I got coffee. I got medieval music, which we're going to turn off for the ambience. And... Uh, I need, yeah, rabbits. Garstedly, garstedly rabbits. Also need to find the other fire so I can get my, my can back. Ha! Oh. I was clicking on it. So am I supposed to run up and hit it with the stone again? Is that the thing? I've got to hit it twice with the stone. It was part of the Epic Games free giveaway. Oop. Uh, yeah, just change that back. This is my bad. My bad. So I hit a rabbit. I knocked it over. I ran to it and clicked on it. And nothing happened. Was that a misclick or was there a step I'm missing? Like, am I supposed to hit it with the stone again? I just forgot to turn off the be right back thing. Should be all fine now. Old camp can. I want the can. That's what I want. Okay, so, no, I just wanted to check that I had the procedure right. If it's a bit of a finicky hitbox, then that's okay. That's all. Oh, run. Gotcha. I need to find some place to escape this cold. Guessing I'm gonna have to craft food. Do I just cook it? Do I have to? Cook. Craft. Guessing I have to gun the thing. Okay, so I have to go it. My inventory. 
is. Okay, harvest. Uh, harvest. Okay. So food cooking take a while. And we got some skin that we can use for something at some point. I'd imagine we get a bow and enough twine and ligaments you can make a bow. Well that's just a guess. Don't think we're suffering from anything. A wolf. Zipper. Cook that we want water that pretty sure that we're not got any affections. Those do have some that is audible and unsafe. We'll drop the unsafe or no way I don't accident drink the unsafe water. So, on to the next rabbit. Come on, my little pretty. Click, click. Oh man, I was clicking on it. Okay, so we're dropping going into inventory here. Okay. Intestines are a gun. Oh, you can craft with them. Okay, so these all have to be air dried indoors before they're usable. That's fair enough. But our hunger is still quite low. I shall drop the guts. We got water cooking for purification. Uh, inventory. Fresh guts. Okay, it needs to air dry for five days though. So I'm guessing I'd have to leave it on the ground for five days. Uh, 
drzwi. I pnie Okay, we're full on water. Well, oh, oh. Oh. so it's basically just unusual until I can. Find a, a decent indoor place, it's not a problem. Alright, elude. Yeah. I think we're doing okay with weight. We are at 10 kilograms out of 30. We've still got plenty of weight. Um, okay, still not 100%, it still gets tired quickly at the moment. But I am trying to push up the content slowly, so I can build up strength again. Um, probably looking at mid-February before it's 100% again. But it, it's doing well. Wabbits? All that. We need fuel for the fire as well. It's unfortunately the voice. It is one of those things I can't rush. I have to wait for it to do its thing. Thank you very much. Uh, no, I, there's, I've had fantastic support from everyone since the problems with the the voice. Um. Yeah, I mean, I'm I'm really not pushing it as much. It is uh, risking permanent injury if I keep pushing. So. I'm trying to take it easy while keep the voice working as much as I can without causing any damage.
I'm treating it like a strain, like a sprained ankle or whatever. I mean, they recommend that you take weight off, but you don't stop using it. Otherwise, it can atrophy and all of that. So I'm trying to, you know, use it and not stress it. Because that doesn't help anybody. Thank you. That means a lot to me. I'm glad you... I mean, like I said, the support has been fantastic. A lot better than what I would have expected. So I do appreciate that from everyone. Much appreciated, Adam. It is much appreciated. Seriously? Throwing stones and pick up the rabbit. Thank you very much, Adam. It is much appreciated. The dono is very, very appreciated. Um, I don't know when I'll be back up to four videos. I don't know if I'll be back up to four videos. The new format does take longer for me to produce. But seeing as I couldn't record quite as much before as before, I decided that that was worth it. But the new format seems to have also gotten quite a good um, reception. So... I'm probably going to keep that format. It does mean content might take a little bit longer to create now because just the overall editing and uptake to make the content is up. But I am definitely aiming for November levels of uh, creation. As I go along, the editing becomes easier as I get more used to it. So over time, it should become um, less of effort to make the new uh, format.
I don't know. Let me check. Might be able to craft. Crafting. No. Not quite enough like for I tea. Another night. I think we need one more bush and we'll have enough. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. We'll keep that. Some food. Every time I hear whatever insect that is, it sounds like a phone ringing. I was like, why the hell's a phone in the middle of the tundra? One that's working. I'm sorry, Adam, can you say that again? What do you mean? For Patreon? Or read? Um, anything over 500, I should be okay. Not great, but I can cover electricity and um, food, some food and water and internet. But for being able to save up and upgrade my computer and stuff, we'll probably need a bit more than that. But we'll get there. Um, last couple of months, I have managed to do it through ad revenue and um, Patreon. Well, I'm in a lucky position that uh, the house I stay in is paid off, so I don't have that, or I, and I don't have any debt.
So uh, not having debt, not having to pay off a house and a car, that makes cost of living a lot lower. No worries, Tanpuk. It, it's entirely optional. Don't feel obliged to donate. If you've got enough, I know it's a tough time for everyone. If you've got enough, then it's appreciated. But look after yourselves first before worrying about me. No worries, Jennifer. Thanks for popping past. It's been a lot of work, but I've seen it as an investment, like a business. Some people say you shouldn't look at it like that, but to me, it's, it's the way I've always approached it. I make content and people like it. They I earn ad, ad revenue or donations, and that's fine. Anything right now. That hungry. What do you want mean by send to me, Adam? Uh, there should be a link to a direct PayPal if that's what you're talking about. That shouldn't appear anywhere. It should be in the description, but I can send it to you. A second. Pause the game before I do anything. Eh.
Okay, no, no worries, I can do that. Um, in the description of the stream is a link to PayPal that directly to buy PayPal. And that won't pop up in the stream at all. As far as I know. And I can keep it on the down low, it's not a problem. Uh, yeah, it should be right at the top of the description. But if you want me to send you a direct link, do that as well. No worries, Dr. Red. It's all good. I should be playing for another hour or so. Well, thanks for popping past as well and just saying hi. It's appreciated. No worries, Tanpuk. <laughs> it's all good. I mean, to me, it's 8 o'clock in the morning, but I know to you guys it's Saturday evening. And silent. Let me just drink some coffee. And keep forgetting to drink. Which means I almost always drink cold coffee. Thankfully, I don't really have a problem with that. You too, Dr. Red, and have fun with your group. Hopefully you don't put them in through too much stuff. Although, if they're being jerks, then you're allowed to throw dragons at them. Okay, uh, just clicking a couple of buttons, making all my screens right again. Hoping I'm not muted. Okay, let's continue. So we're in daytime, we're decently fed. Ah, it's weekend. So, no worries with that. I think what we're going to do is kill a rabbit, cook it, and take it with us. Because I'm guessing we need to make it to the next... Um, but for the story to progress. So the, the pebble icon has bugged out and now it looks like a snowball, which I think is funny. Okay, I, I was just double checking. I was using the thumb just now, then I moved to the forefinger. Because the spacing seemed to be off slightly. We can cook one of those. Cool. I suppose having the medicine the inventory is going to help.
I love it how a, a tea mug just materializes out of nowhere. Okay, so we walked in from the top there. Came in from the top there. Through yonder. It would be heading. Gonna break. Nope. Down. Okay. Then I'm guessing. Gonna be heading in this. Maybe. Astrid. Oh, roses. I almost passed it up. That's a wolf. That's a bad thing. I'm guessing it's going to take a little more than a bop in the head with a pebble to get rid of the wolf. Well, that's rule one for survival in any situation. Anybody who enjoys survival shows or that sort of thing. Shelter is more important than pretty much everything else. We're being sneaky sneaky. Radio tower. To civilization than I thought. More importantly, medicine. Oh, don't climb. Again. I. Not sure what you mean, Tampa. I mean, I don't know what stats mean to me, but I have no idea what it means in the context of this game. It's quite immersive. I'll give it that, even with the the art style. I'm guessing our goal is to head towards the tower. Looks like I'm crouching.
Don't, don't, don't. Sign. That says radio tower that way. Pointing to the big radio tower. Very, very helpful. Yeah, we're almost there. Build a fire over here. No jump, damn it. Whoa. Someone's just sitting here, frozen. What the hell? Ooh. Painkillers. Scenic view. Great. Town. <laughs> well, like I need somebody to tell me it's a scenic view. <laughs> okay, we got shelters down there. Okay, so I'm guessing that's our next step. Weave our way down into one of those houses. Whilst harvesting everything. Yep, 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 yep. Got you. I got you. We're almost in the home run, dude. Well, not home run, but house over there. Gonna make life easier. Look. Smoke from that chimney. Well kudos to your observational skills. At least we're warming up now. Holy shit! Uh, wait! Hold your fire! Get back. O okay, okay. Just take it easy. Why are you here? I saw the smoke from your chimney. Outsider. Uh, what? <laughs> Thoughts not. Maybe. This isn't an ominous conversation. Just saying. You haven't left like the others. So, must be a mainlander. Someone who doesn't know any better. My plane, I, I crashed in the mountains nearby. I'm looking for someone who crashed with me. A friend. She might be injured. I haven't seen her. You're blind. Listen, could you maybe point that gun someplace else? You think because my eyes are covered, I can't see you? Make the wrong move, say the wrong thing. You'll see how good a shot I am. Okay, he's not blind. I don't doubt it. The others are all gone. If you're here, Things must be worse than they thought. Name's Mackenzie, by the way. It was an interesting way to do the conversational dialogue. I like it. I had a name once. But for years, the townsfolk have called me Grey Mother. The name takes on its own life, such that at one point, 
The name becomes the thing it belongs to. Then the old names fade. Can only be remembered by the young and the true. So, I should call you... You should call me Grey Mother also. Where are we? No one. It's a gun town, peeping around us. You're far from home. But I got there by the plane. Where are we on Great Bear? My plane came down in a storm, and my compass was acting funny. I've lived here all my life. Not much use for the inside world. Milton is the last of the old mountain towns. Now, it's almost impossible. Or get out of here. Only people left here are either too poor or too proud to leave. Which are you? I have what I need. At least I did before the bad man came. Now I'm not sure I have enough to get through the winter. I need to find my friend. Foreboding. But I'll do what I can to help. My mind. Like a dream. Let me think. Let me rest. Maybe I can pull some memories out of the fog. Maybe I can find something that could help you find your friend. Adam, that is entirely up to you. I don't mind either. If you're going to stay, that's great. If you want to go out to a bar, that's also fine. Just as long as you're not drinking and driving, should be fine. I'm going to need to rest soon. Find a bed in here. Table. Ah, random bullet holes. Looking bad. At all. Food. I think I'm going to go into one of the other houses. Okay. Talk to it about the gun. Big gun. rifle in your hand. Are you expecting trouble? Trouble? God. Trouble. You woke up fast. You mean the storm? The bad men. The bad men came. Okay, so the blue uh, selection is plot related. Oh, they are, noted. They are safe. Because Grey Mother can't see. <laughs> they were wrong. Like I said, the, the blood outside was the bad men. The, bad men? the men, they, they passed them down. The night of the storm. The night of the fights. I'm looking for my friend. She crashed with me when my plane came down in the mountains. Do you think she could have come through and been caught by these bad men? I can't say for sure. Is your friend the survivor? I... Yes. She is. Then there is always hope. The bad men. Did they try to hurt you? Everyone thinks being old means you live. But they underestimate. Seems they did. I crashed without much food or gear myself. And if these bad. Sorry about that, I'm just. 
Making sure the volumes are okay. Okay. We'll have their own wives. It's up to you, outsider. I'll do what I can, but I'll need your help. There must be somewhere in town to get food, fuel, the essentials. What about your friend? Are you in a hurry to find her? Yes, I am. And I'll be looking for signs of her. There is a lot of ground to cover, and without gear, So while I'm looking for supplies, you see what you can remember about the Magatha Lights, and if she might have passed through town. That way, maybe we can help each other. Okay, outsider. Great Mother can't promise she can unlock the secrets in the dark cupboards of her mind. I shall try. how I can get out of this town? I need to find help. The old quake closed down most of the roads in and out of town. That was years ago. Blizzard just swept through town after the power went out. As for help, you won't find any out there. You're on your own. We both Thank you again, Adam. And I will remember that and... I'm glad that you guys enjoy my content. Have fun and be safe. Why? It's what you are, isn't it? From the mainland, an outsider. You don't really belong here, do you? Okay, but you sound bitter about it. We lost everything in the collapse. People didn't realize how dependent we'd become. Some were fine with it. Others didn't want the scraps from your table. Created deep rifts in families, communities. Scars would never heal. The mainland had become our lifeline and we were suddenly cut. And so we suffered. But I guess I don't know much about that history. I'm not surprised. You mainlanders have always been focused on your own story. Only interested in Great Bear when it had something to give you. If you can't cut it down or dig it out of the ground, what use is it to you? The town seems so quiet. Does anyone still live here? Not many. After the earthquakes, less. I can understand that. Even where did everyone go? That I cannot say. All I know is that I heard screams and could smell smoke for most of the night. You mentioned smelling smoke? Someone came here. One of the townsfolk tried to convince me to leave. They said there were houses burning in the town. They said people were scared and were leaving for the coast <laughs> on foot. That uh, doesn't sound like a good idea. Plan, but that's what they said to do after the quakes. If there was ever another emergency, go to the coast and help will come. They wanted me to go with them. But I'm not ready to leave Milton you here? Alone? I'm not alone. I have my Lily. Lily? Never mind. The power seems out all over town. The power's always been spotty here since the quakes. No money to fix the broken stuff left behind. 
Apparently nobody from the mainland seemed to care enough to do anything about it. I'm sure someone will come and fix it. Nobody's coming to save you. How can you be so sure? I've learned to hear the difference between something quiet and something abandoned. This goes deeper than just the stillness. It feels like the moments before the world goes to sleep. We're just the last ones left awake to notice it. What really happened here? Seems like people were here recently. Where did they go? Why didn't they call for help or just drive out? The power went out. Who knows the reason? People started to get cold, hungry. They panicked, started to talk crazy. Others walked here from the highway. Some belonged here. Others were outsiders, like you. Did you too, Adam. Brown hair, would have had a tan jacket, a scarf with, with birds on it. Possibly injured. Just give me a second, I'll be right back. Sorry, back. Somebody was knocking on the door. I had to check what was happening. Um. Yes, I I'm not sure what you're talking about, Adam. That's true. Now, what are we doing? Clicking these buttons and starting again. I heard her pass through. She wasn't alone. As my dad used to say, you can call me anything you want as long as it's not late for dinner. But the storm was too loud. Voices? All good, Tan Perk. I'm English and I misspell horribly, so I've got no excuse. Before you mentioned hearing voices, do you remember what you heard? Memories are great. Mystery. I must say the voice acting is quite good. I'm trying to remember. It was windy. Blizzard was already waking up. But I heard yelling a scream was it a woman's voice i'm not sure the voices were thin far 
blizzard was waiting, how soon there was only wind and darkness, I don't know. I don't remember. It's all cloudy now. Got a map. Nice. Um, if you're talking about me, it's male pronouns. Being called female pronouns before as well, that's fine. But I'm a male and married and all that stuff. This stuff will come in handy. I learned the book. Like a skill book. Okay. So having the book increases my crafting option. Yeah. Uh, I get what you're saying. Is the eye icon for fatigue? I was like, I can just block. Okay, it is. Another two hours. It should help. We're indoors, so we shouldn't have to worry about the wind shear. We're tired, we're thirsty, we're ravenous. All not good things. Although, we should be able to do water. We got. Yummy. You too, Adam. Stay safe. Keep well. Hopefully your hangover isn't too bad in the morning. this is on the map I think we shall use this as our base of operations and a craft a robot with its pieces Turned out 
pretty well. All right. Get some nice greasy food. And I'll watch the footy. Do I cook that? <clears throat> Just like on the plate. No, no pan or anything. Never directly onto the plate. Makes sense. Although I suppose if I was going to be smart about this, I would sleep till morning. But I've never claimed to be smart. Okay, so it does have my relative position to my base of operations. That's good. Because sitting in a fire uh, in a car with a flare going is safe. We're we going up the road towards the church. Imagine what are we supposed to do. Check the gas station. Right. which would probably be in the intersection. Bank. Looks like a town hall. It makes sense. Office. This is the side we came in from, pretty sure. Milton had a hidden cash note. Hey girl, that grumpy jerk orca left the back door open, so I snuck in and took some stuff. I thought we might need it for when we get out of here. Can't wait to get over the mainland with you, where we can finally be together for real. I'll meet you there tomorrow night, like we planned. I stashed the stuff near the big fallen tree in the marshy area behind St. Christopher's. You know, where we met that one time for a drink and drank your dad's contraband. Oh, leave it. So there's a cash behind the church. Gotcha. 
We're looking for the petrol stick. That looks like a petrol station. That is a petrol station. But that would explain why it looks like one. I see the logic there. Sign that says Milton. Stranger, have you escaped the town? Escaped the town? No, I just arrived. Not a refugee from the highways, then. You look weary, traveler. Come, warm yourself by the fire. Who are you? I'm nobody. But you can call me Methuselah. I'm here to witness the passing of an age. Okay. What do you mean the passing? Methuselah. Don't you see the signs? Any idea why all the cars are stalled and left behind? They all stopped running. People abandoned them. Nothing but metal coffins now. So it's sounding like a big e you EMP. My heart weeps for you, stranger. My days are nearly finished. You'll have to live with what remains. You seem oddly familiar, old man. Is that right? Yeah. And this whole place feels strange and empty. The quakes changed everything here years ago. Great Bear's back was broken, and it's been laid low ever since. And what are you still doing here? Aren't we here to witness an apocalypse of an apocalypse, you and I? No one thought the world would end this way. But how could they not have seen it? It's probably just the storm. The power failure. I'm sure everything will be back to normal in a few days. I'm not sure anything will ever be. What is this town? I don't recall seeing it on any maps. This is Milton. <laughs> Paradise lost. It's a town of the old world. Discarded, left behind. You won't find much hope. I need to find my friend. I'm not sure you'll find any friends here. I'm looking for my friend. She was with me when my plane crashed. But it looks like she must have made it out alive. Have you seen anyone pass by here? Many people have passed. All have gone into the town. I haven't seen any come back. Okay. Go good. safely. Good to know. Good luck to you. I hope you find what you're looking for.
how is he opening this can? With just his teeth. Okay, so harvesting everything. No, <laughs> no, I ran from the first wolf that I saw. I, I'm not ashamed to say that with my pebble in hand, I didn't think I was equipped to deal with a wolf at that point. Is that the Firefox logo? Is that my imagination? The old Firefox logo. Come on, start up. I'm sure that's the old Firefox logo. I could be wrong. Food, it's good. It's very good. We do need. Okay. Okay. Uh -huh. Shanty. That's interesting. That means that at some point we do get a hacksaw and a machete. Something to keep an eye out for. I got a bed here, so I think something is sapping my energy. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, I think we'll go with. Feels like and I'm uh, encumbered, so that's good. I think we'll give it four hours of sleep. Okay, we'll check that now. Is it the tiredness was reaching red line? I'm also
hungry. Drop those. In case we need them. I'm playing the story mode at the moment. So I'm moving as fast as the story allows. I only started playing today. We're gonna unfold as fast as the story allows. But I'm not gonna make sticks out of uh, tinder plugs out of sticks because we've got pretty much everything we need. Are, however, I think, close to encumbered. That. That. Oh, no, that's dog food. Oh, that was a, a cool drink. Which, by the way, is what we call soda here. Cool drinks. We don't really call them sodas. Random. Okay. So let's see. We're doing pretty well. Could use some more steak, but I don't think that's going to happen. Okay, we're out of fuel. Hope I can still eat this. Well, you can eat it, and <laughs> whether you should eat it is a a different story. Okay, next bit of text. Highway robbery. Hey bud, sorry to leave you hanging like this, with the storm and the power and everything. But it sounds like it's all gone to hell out in the upper bridge tonight. Cars broken down, a mess, and some rich mainlander won't budge from his truck. Probably thinks we're all a bunch of bandits waiting to rip him off. Usual story. Anyway... Me and Jason are going to go up there and see if we can talk some sense into him before the storm gets even worse. I'll sort you out in the morning. Thanks, Peter. Uh, okay. Learn to mend and maintain clothing. Right, we picked that up. These are side quests, but we got the book. So if I... Aha! There we go. Cloth. Eh. I love the, the knee patch. That's like a bandage built into it. That is the uh, 
convenience of it. It's got a pre-bandaged knee for when you scrape it. Well, there are quite a few uh, early access games that uh, start off good and they just get better. Okay. Thick. Got 100%. Got... Actions right up here. Oh, no, no, oh, cancel. That was close. That was very close. Actions. Yeah. Okay, so we're out of cloth. That's fine. Very much so, James. It, it, it is. There are some that never come out of ac open access, and then there are gems that just keep slogging at it. And they deserve all the credit they can get. Got gloves, so uh, too much of a problem. But we should be able to taken. Harvest it. Secured leather. Is we can't wear both of them at the same time, and the other jacket gives us more in the way of uh, protection. We all scavenge that and use the cloth to repair the other one. Um, same as uh, the zombie apocalypse one. Zomboids, something like that. There's a bunch that it's just one creator and he's just been slogging at it for years. And I have th the utmost respect for those guys. And they deserve all the success they can get. Right, bring a lot better in the hole. History of the Collapse, Part 1. You must tell me if you guys want me to do this narration thing with the notes in game or just, you know, read it to myself and expect you guys to read it. Don't really mind either way. History of the Collapse, Part 1 In the mid-20XX, the ongoing global economic crisis, fueled by continued political instability in the US and Europe, contributing to increasing volatility in the financial markets, led to the sudden catastrophic collapse of the Canadian and, in general, the North American banking system. 
This immediately rendered a Canada currency worthless, triggered superinflation of the US dollar, and all the economic activity promptly shifted to the Chinese yuan or the cryptocurrencies a la Bitcoin. Crippled economically, Canada was brought under the financial oversight of the North American Economic Zone, which positioned Canada as a kind of protectorate of a larger US-based economic bloc. From this point onward, the majority of economic activity became centralized on Canada's already densely urbanized population, with smaller rural, uh, smaller rural and remote communications being essentially off. Without a local economic lifeline, many of these communities had become dependent on for their own continued existence. Most rural or remote communities became hollowed out as people fled to urban areas in such of greater economic stability. Okay, so the world went to crap and Canada became a superpower. Right, that's cool. Um, I played Star Dew Valley way back when. I still think I've got it. Uh, we've got everything from this room that we can get. We're going to take that, though. Take it. Not nailed down. Take it. Okay, so we can get a hatchet, a machete... New socks. And more bandages. Painkillers. We got the socks. What do we got? We got you and you. Okay. And those two are the same, and this is slightly different. That. Wait, waterproof. So to me, it looks like the ragged woolen socks are better than the decent sport socks. Yes. Yeah. Woohoo! New socks! So what we'll do is... To... Harvest. Which one of these has the most? That one. That one. Has the least. So we're going to harvest this one, keep the other one. Um, they've act it seemed to me that they had the same heat rating, but the wool ones have better waterproofing. Which, I suppose, increases heat rating if you're not wet. Okay, and now that they've been fully repaired, the heat rating comes up. Duly duty. Noted. Live and learn, live and learn. Okay, so that's fully repaired. We don't have any more cloth. That's fine. Oh, I don't want to pull yet. Double check we've got anything of importance. Uh, 
in there keep her yeah, we'll stumble back towards the bridge drop off all everything we can then we finish that side quest as well maybe I don't rest soon I'm gonna faint yes yes side quest Just mustn't forget that there is a hidden stash behind the church. So I'm gonna drink by snow. Nothing to drink. Fine. We can do this. Learn to use the radio mem menu. Get back to the house, drop off all the stuff, get some sleep, and then see where we are. Pretty sure running while tired doesn't help, but... Empty this. Okay, we've got three cans now. Good. Life easier. Painkillers, antibiotics, bandages. Mm. Actually, I need to leave these out, don't I? And we'll drop them on the floor here. Way they can dry in the air. Good. There we go. Bad. What else we got? Got eight of those. Some sticks. Some bandages. There. Okay, well, we don't need that. Pretty sure we only need two cans. Those. Did you drink? Thank you. It's a pity you can't combine the boxes of matches into one box. Well, I suppose you're more worried about spa uh, weight than you are space. Wander upstairs, get some shut eye. Maybe eight hours should be enough. But we were pretty fatigued, so I don't know.
Okay, eight hours almost took us all the way back. Just do another four hours and try to get full up on the steep. Bit weird not having background music, but I think that would kind of ruin the game. Okay, we're good. Okay, so... I'm not allowed to eat the food that I put into the Take the soda. Got tons of coffee. Oh, to make coffee. I was double clicking to take it out, but it was telling me I couldn't. I could take the cool drink out. I think it's things part of the quest I can't take out. But I could take out the sardines. So oh, I don't know what, why it's. I think it's related to the quest. Turned out pretty well. Water. Yeah. Water. Maybe. I'm assuming that time still progresses while my inventory is open. Okay, so if we've got this fuel, then surely we should be able to put it into our thing. Actions. Be fuel. Ah. Good. Okay, we don't have any more fuel. That's fine. I just remember to turn it off when I'm not using it.
or do that um, advanced time advanced time thing and do that either eh, well what We need to go to the church, check out the stash there, but I also pretty sure I saw a house that didn't have boarded up doors on the way back, so we can probably go get in there as well. Uh gonna drop all the medicine in the cupboard. Else don't we need those right now? Stones right now. Just trying to optimize how much weight we can carry. I went up. Okay. That's my I just wanted to get some food and water before I rested more. Anyway. I want to go do that during the day. Take that. Drop that. Don't want to accidentally drink that. And we'll wait until morning. Okay, okay, good to know. Good to know. Any way to tell what time of day it is? Morning Muscup, how you doing? And I'm definitely taking it slow. It took us three deaths to get this far. Two deaths. But we're meandering along quite nicely. Yes, we don't need the thingy out. So I can take that away. We can pick up the can. And Start fire. We're gonna start fire for. Uh... Yeah, that looks good. So I'll leave all three cans on top there. It'll make some potable water for me. I didn't start. Up. Can't boil water if you don't have a fire. Come on. Come on. All right. Hmm. 
six pitch. That should work. Water two. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, water there. Doesn't take space. Rip it. Rip it. Well, if it boils up, it's not a major train smash. But I want to use the sunlight as up. I'm going to go look at that house and then maybe make a dash for the church. So I've got a liter of water on me and there should be a bunch of... I'm like a walking junkyard. got the post office, but then there was also this house here yeah, that didn't seem to have anything on the door. I don't know whether this is related to the story or just a place where we can get stuff. Post office also looked open, so we'll go nick everything we can. Boxes. Good. Need the firewood right now. We get some material that we can pair our stuff with. Six. Medicinal plants. I'm guessing that's one of the yep. main items. Didn't think I can use this. A decent pair of wool socks. Quest, highway robbery, basics of survival. 
Old man's beard. And in inventory, we should have a note. Yeah. I fall under examine Milton post office note Margaret we have to stop accepting mail from Milton we have no way of getting it back to the mainland but we can't tell people that or they'll know that we've been holding on to it all this time find some excuse Whenever you can, encourage people to use email or a drone if they can afford it. I'll keep my eyes open for the mail van, but I won't hold up high hopes. I imagine Jack probably drove it into a tree again, somewhere way back on 40. We're likely to never find it back. Damn, I should have stopped him from taking the truck while he was on the drink. I'll see what I can do to fix the situation. Hold tight. Hmm. Eh, what am I doing? Looking at books. General notes. Nothing. Oh. Hey there, I'm lost. Help. That was like my entire stream a couple days ago. Hey system. Okay. Okay, so we need to fill up the fire bin for the main quest. We need to... Check the church near the bridge outside Milton. And then we need to make some reishi tea, some old man's beard wound dressing, and rose hip tea. Okay. All sounds interesting. My shank chib is uh, not doing too well, so I'm not going to be breaking down cobble boxes for now. I want to preserve that until I can repair it, sharpen it, or replace it. I might need it for something else. So we've got the church and the bridge, which should have supplies. I'm sure in one of these sheds, we should be able to find a axe, get wood. Or just find wood. A bridge. That is a uh, pretty far away. Okay. I think for now we'll search the houses that we can. Done that one. We've done that one. It's a bit windy out today. Back door. I'm gonna take it as a bad sign that the wind's picking up that much. Uh, nope. Cabinet. This will come in handy. Matches. Mm. 
your thing. I'll be hungry later. Um, we're actually hungry now, so we might want to do that. Okay, tier for the letter. Read text. I don't want to do this, but I don't have a choice. I just can't stay in Milton anymore. It's just too empty and sad. I know I promised to stick with you through thick and thin, but I never signed up for this. I I'm sorry. I I'll send food when I, I get to the mainland. I hear they have more there. Love, N. Okay. Freezer. Fridge. Nothing, nothing. Metal container. Ooh. Nobody needs this anymore. We shall take that. That. So we've got a second. Oh, both. Got a beanie and a baseball cap. That's T-shirt. Uh, yes, I. Shirt. Guessing that a T-shirt is gonna fit in. It. But we can. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Gloves, we can not do this now. We'll wait until later. Stick to the advice. Work at night, safety, explore during the day. Good advice. Makes sense. Um. Bank managers. Hmm. Pretty sure we'd find that in the bank. If I had to guess. Lots of burnt out houses and broken down houses. Come on. On the other side. Garage, we pretty much picked that clean. We'd have to go back with tools for there. in this one so don't remember the screen wallpaper there's another room at the back here yeah we'll risk the durability on the knife for Yoga food. Oh.
Okay, I think that's downstairs done. You're looking a little pale there, my friend. Maybe you should get more sunlight. Thank you, thank you very much. Use more food. Guessing that would be a, a accessory. Good. Mm -hmm. Strangely enough, the baseball cap provides me with less protection. I, I would never have guessed. was a proper book, wasn't it? No, it wasn't. Well, that was a lumberjack book. Could end up being useful. Take that. So when we get into the bank, we can open up one of the safety deposit boxes. Nice. Moldy chocolate, that sounds divine. Okay. We're heading that way. Yes, we were heading that way. Right. Blue house, head there. Oh, nope. Metal containers, crates. I think I've been in here before. Yeah.
Okay. We're back up to the crossroad. We've got almost full, so I think we'll head back indoors, drop off some stuff, and take over there. doesn't sound ominous at all not like it's right behind okay sure there is something behind me. Just to remind me that I'm not safe. Okay, so we've got all the firewood, all the bridges full. Oh, there's a lot of stuff in the. Okay, that's good. Take these. We've got pots. So that should make life easier as well. Drop some stuff in the fridge first. Mm. Don't need to take the coffee with me. All the chocolate. Jerky. Mm. I also wanted to... Was it? Uh, lame. Well, this we've got a bunch of fuel. We don't. Okay. Fair enough. And we're gonna put our medicine in there. Because we'll put the matches outside, but they don't take up a lot of space. Or oh, weight. Stare to fire. Don't have wood. Maybe we should be able to drop the two pots on the stove. Good. Not allowing me to take wood either. Okay, so I think I need to finish the quest so that I can take stuff out of the fridge and the wood again. Hey. 
Hello. Friend. Have you been able to remember anything else about that night? Anything that might help me find my friend? I'm back in that night. Moin howling. Voices passing through town. I can hear them just outside the window. It's windy, but the voices carry. They are yelling. The voice, it passes through town. She's running. She's alone, calling for help. But no one comes. Why didn't anyone help her? Yes. Why didn't they? They should have. They should have found her before it was too late. Anything else you can remember might help. They said men came from the tunnel. What about the tunnel? The only way out of the mountain. The only way through the mountains. It's the only way she could. It was the mole people. They made their old tunnel, oh, their own tunnel. On the way into town, there's an old man. Glasses, big beard, walking stick. He seemed uh, a little odd. I don't sound like anyone from that one. Most of the elderly have gone. Or died. I'm the only one left. The only one from the old days. The old man outside of town. Methuselah. He said he'd seen other people walking towards Milton. Other outsiders? It's possible. And where would they be? Maybe my friend was with them. If they were outsiders, they might have stayed in the old schoolhouse. In the months after the quakes, people used to huddle there for the warmth of the school's old coal burner. A rare outsider coming through Milton might stay there the night. If your friend came through Milton, chances are she ended up there. Okay. New quest. What I'm going to do is quickly have a, a little bit of a break. I'm gonna make some coffee at the bathroom, and I will be back in a couple minutes. I will leave you with the soothing sounds of uh, our humble bundle playlist. A be right back screen. I will be right back in a couple minutes.
Okie dokie. We are back. I think, yep, the microphone's working. I remember to change the screen. And we got the game. Oh, and I got another note. Weather warning, heavy snow and record low temperatures. Eh. I could have told you that, and I don't even know anything about snow and stuff. She won't like it one bit, but we'll need to check on her. Someone has to. Okay. Okay. Who is... Eh. Inventory management. The excitement of inventory. I'm gonna drop the pots here. Drip. Cans here. Drip. Not gonna drop the crap in there. The Flare stuff we don't need. Got shirt, we just rip apart. Harvest, harvest. Got the baseball cap. Harvest. And the gloves. 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 Key gloves. Oh, right. we also picked up a new pair of socks. I'm gonna put those on. Okay. Two. Harvest. Here. Well, now we don't need a bedroll because we've got a place to sleep. Now, uh, what else? Put some water into the fridge. Carry a liter of water with us. Thereabouts. Should be enough. Where are we down to? 8 kilograms. That's good. Drop a bunch more stuff into the wood bin. Got a lot of that. I think that is Oh, we're at the intersection again Well, we're looking at the map God. That appears to be east and west to explore And then we'll explore North lost that road. I think we'll do east first because there's only these four houses, and west will probably have to be in the morning, but these houses quite far out. 
Okay, plan of action. Get into the bank. If we can. There's a note on the door. Go read the note on the door. Note door. What is it? Read text. September 2012. Dear members, due to global economic realities that are well known to you, we are unfortunately unable to remain in operation. All banking services are hereby woof until further woof management. No, that doesn't sound on Let's get indoors. This bank's got a lot of random empty boxes. Why would a bank have random empty boxes? And I can understand it for the convenience shop. Hey, we can go to the bank manager's house. Um, well, actually, we're hungry now. Might as well drink food and energy and liquid. All the good stuff needed for survival. beans. Ah, we can survive the apocalypse. We've got beans. With that, no wolf would want to come near us because of the smell.
Take that if you need to. And using gamer logic, I've got the bank manager's house key. I'm guessing the combination or the key to the vault will be in his house. Put all that cardboard and stuff into the bin. And let's we'll see if we can make it to the bank manager's house before nightfall. Not looking good though. Bank manager's house. Uh, I should probably check my map. Yeah, yeah. Been in here before. We'll head back indoors, eat, drink, fix stuff, and then uh, sleep. That wolf howling just definitely, um, seriously. can't take anything out of there so I'm gonna have to be careful of what I'd put in there unless it's related to a quest again that quest okay it's probably related to the side quest uh, uh, one, two, two, fuel, and feather and stuff. Let's head towards about a hundred, nine, fifty one actions, repair. Nope, 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 don't harvest it. Fix the socks. Okay, our socks are good. Use, could use a repair. Good as new. Mittens. Repair.
Yeah, I think that's us pretty much 100% done. Inventory. Into the cloth. Fire. Is. Harvest this. much wearing everything else food oh we got light on Uh, that probably wasn't the bestest idea. Water. Fruity drink. Fruity drink. And Okay. Need. Have those have well, some painkillers talking about I'm talking about something else. Haven't it? I think it's the antibiotics that we're talking about. Oh, well, we're gonna have a long sleep anyway. We should, in as we're pretty repaired, be able to drop the cloth in here. Let's save up some weight. Purple tea. No painkillers can. Uh, beans can go in. Oh, I can in a coffee. Whole part of the house I didn't explore. I did. Good night's sleep. And continue on in the morning.
Okay. We should be able to leave now and go look for the manager's house. First, let's just explore up here. It's only these three houses. Door to nowhere. I can always use more food. Nice. Yeah. Want those food? Is that I better take this food? But so we'll pretty much just eat anything we find for now. Got another beanie. Good. Make any difference in the two beanies? Uh, five. Keep the scarf on and the beanie. Not two beanies. Fair enough. This will come in handy. Ah, we got a hatchet. That's what we need. Leather. What happened here? Hatchet.
Yeah, that doesn't look like it was quick or pleasant. So, if I... That road leads to somewhere in these mountains. I'm not going to follow that because who knows where it comes out. Fine here. Go check the sign out. Radio tower. Okay, so it comes up around here. Oh, so this is the one I actually came in on road. Bank. For some reason, I seem to think it was the blue house that was managers, but comfy because it's all wrecked. This is the one with the flag. Ah. That makes sense. It sticks out visually. Stuff will come in handy. So we're looking for a combination rock or a key. I can always use more food. end up being useful. That's got some decent stuff. Probably makes sense because it was locked. What have we here? Thirteen thirty-eight. Should take it so we can I could use this.
here. Use the simple part. Huh? Using over there. Okay. Warmth bonus plus 12. Wind protection. Awesome. Our sprint is slowed down, but I'd rather be a bit slow than die of cold. So if we go back to the bank, we should be able to open up the vault of the safe. It was thirteen. Uh, I check your information. That nineteen thirty. Oh. wrong <laughs> that would explain it it's the wrong dirty Okay, so that means you could just um, brute force it to get the code. So we'll brute force the smaller safe. We don't get something from here that gives us the code. Number seven. Going home. This will come in handy. Okay. Just an odd thing to have in a safety deposit box. Keeping a candy bar in the safety deposit box, that makes sense. Okay. I think that's it eating. Well.
50. Easy peasy. That'll come to you. Or absolutely nothing really. Okay, we're uh, pretty full. Stagger back and drop off our stuff. Do any crafting we can. Fire now, hopefully. Good morning, Dave Dave, and how are you doing? And definitely for the algorithm. Some that hook that 
that because we need to cook three of them for the side quest. Cook that some herbal tea because we can. Ink, have a look see. What do our side quests say? We want some uh, rosehip tea. We'll make two of those, three of those. We want to. I'm glad to hear it, Dave. Dave, you should probably head to bed then. I imagine it's quite late for you. Quests. Uh, quest. Start to fire more. Copy the Eek. add something. Oh, nice. Two hours. Eek. False pan. Herbal tea. Eek. Water. Hey, this is I'm getting cured out eventually. We wanna put it. I suppose. Yeah. Probably don't want to eat the moldy fish. That doesn't sound like it's a good idea. Inventory. Clothes. Harvest. What else? Sneakers. What do they do for us? Um, we'll compare them. Socks, you will suck. Here we shall harvest. I 
I left my lantern on again, so I've run out of fuel. Check these shoes. To me, the, the leather boots be better, but... Um, alternative would probably be the general consensus. Bit of metal or alt metal, that sort of stuff. Those are waterproof. Those are not. Those are warm. Those are not. These are heavy. Those are not. Yeah. I'll drop the. These can get harvested. Anything else for him? What's this? There's a worn wool sweater. We'll wear that. So we've got two sweaters on. Just repair it as well. And we'll repair that one. And one more repair. Good to do it. Hopefully. After I hit my microphone a couple times, just to you know, make sure everybody's awake. And we'll repair you. So that should give us plus 13. It's not bad. I wasn't smart of you. News for eight hours. Didn't need much more than that. Quest. A6 up. Okay. The cup of hope in there. The Dean. Herbal mixture can go in there. cups yeah crap can go in there that can go in there lost bandages in there if we get wounded we can always come back box Needs to get on apart. Water, I think we'll leave four liters behind. Or three and a half. Right. Okay. Now I'll leave the socks behind because I want to go. Stuff done. Those. Um, I wonder if I can.
Buzz. Three. Click on new actions. Refuel. That. Okay. I can keep the fuel in the cabinet. I'm not carrying around that extra stuff. Uh, I think that it is good. You should craft all the newspapers and stuff into tinder plugs so they take up less inventory it helps with inventory management hungry not a surprise Sodas, which give us more food for now. I agree with you, but we can't take anything out the fridge. Here we shall go explore again. This time we'll head to the west of the intersection. A car. Pick an interest. Sounds um close. But oh, that's fun. Not ominous at all. Working on it, dude. Why keep food in your cupboards in your kitchen? I mean, that would just be crazy. Never mind. Because there's no gas. Evil as 
do need wood, but all of this stuff's going to take up more space. Hope I can still eat this. Well, I suppose if I'm going to do it, I might as well do it right and clear the, clean the houses up properly. We do need a lot of the wood for that side quest, well, the main quest. We're taking it down to rafters. All I can think about is food. Very much. Searched everything. I think it's a, a slow paced game until you make a mistake and then it becomes an emergency in a Great pace. I only died three times getting to this village. No, I don't know whether that speaks more to the difficulty of the game or my gaming skills, but take that however you want. We've also got wolves running around. I want to avoid those. Power lines going in. Random house, aren't you? Hello, wolf. Yes, yes. Okay, so that's back from when I came. That's the random house on the map. Which we can. Locked. Good. Have a look around. Getting a wood cabin. I see some chopped trees. I wonder if there will be an axe around. This must be a... I don't know what you call it. A wood lodge. Where you... Hang up your boots after chopping down trees for the day. Biz, chat, cardboard, container, plant fuel, could be useful. Woody. Probably a bad idea, but my dude's hungry.
thirsty. Good enough. Yeah, that's not good. Than dark and foreboding at all. I, I actually really like the fact that at the bottom left there it shows you how many calories you've got so it's uh, before starvation and then how many calories the job is going to take you to do so, i mean it definitely adds to the realism want to say So your biggest worry is not only time, it is calories, which is what you would have in a survival situation anyway. Yeah? I could eat anything. The hidden cash note. Read text. I don't trust anyone more anymore. People are getting desperate, and it's only been a few days since the power went out. I'm going to stash some supplies in our special place above town. You know, near where we look at the stars together. We may need them before help gets you. I'm guessing that's the observation post at the top of the... Well, what do we have here? Aha, yes. Okay, and then... Yeah. But we're not going to do that during the day. That's the observation post. Another one over there. Okay, that's the main quest. That's the side quest. We came in through this side. So, yes, there by the tower. All right, I know what we're doing. There's another cache behind the church. One by the bridge. an eight hour sleep and move on to the next area the next house although we probably want what's in that cache so we'll go over there uh, left the light on bad bit keep forgetting to do that sounds not so hungry in my life Not sounding pleasant out there, so we'll give it another two hours, see what is happening, and go back. I think we need to go for the cash first, or anything else. Which is right over there. We needed to make tea with this. There's one of the requirements for the side quest. I'm going to take it that there's another plant that I need to get for the other one. to lose over there I'm gonna need to eat some. Yeah, working on it working on it in the 
the right direction. Have the petrol station. Ah. I'm really not liking the sound of that. Okay. Hello, wolf. Bye, wolf. Oh, that's fun. Water. We'll leave the vehicle on the opposite side. Go away. I think one away. Nope, that's definitely not away. Okay. Front. Into the house, which is safe, but there's no food in here. Hopefully the wolf stole not following me. So, if my calculations are correct, maybe. That. Gotta be a gamble. So there should be a cache on the other side of the radio tower. Uh, 
map says that way. I'm gonna have to leave something behind. Huh? Oh, that makes sense. Where we are supposed to be going? There you are. I need more of that. Could Ooh, end up being MRE. Useful. Exactly what we needed. Okay. Other than that, there wasn't really much inside the hidden cache. Clothes, which was a... Accessory. Okay. Good. Probably want to repair that. That doesn't fall apart on us. Because that would be bad. Check out here. I think most of the weight is in the wood at the moment. We've got some aqua tabs. Blair. Okay. Are still encumbered, so if we look at clothing. Share harvest to you. I think we'll drop some wood. Yeah. So we found the cash. Dude. Yeah, that's where I came in from originally. This is the way we want to go. No, no, I, I've not fallen into water yet. I imagine that is a uh, detrimental, seeing as there's no jump. I was chased by a wolf not too long ago. And almost starved to death. So, there is that.
make our way back to the main house, drop off the extra wood we've got. And then clear out our inventory, repair, and see where we stand. Transfer almost all of it. Keep fire for ourselves. But 20 of those, so we will transfer. I think keep fire for ourselves. Be hot. Got matches. Matches. Paper, paper, books. Money. Paper, paper, paper. Uh, be a good chunk close to wherever we were. What did we want? Okay. Um, extra supplies. Okay, we've got enough wood. I take stuff out the wood one now. Be nice. I cannot. Okay. I, I, they normally add the story stuff last because then all the basic game mechanics are in that makes Get sense my hands. okay we got the stuff there what we wanted got the fire with all of that fine here Got one of the herbal concoctions, so we can make that. Okay. Duke. Prof. Want to do is prepared those things. Make more. Yep. Yeah, those also tend to be one of the last things that um, happen. Just because it makes life easier. Uh, and people have to really play the game before you can make those quality of life improvements. Had a bunch of stuff needed to be torn apart and crafted. Craft the under plugs. All of them. And that one. I'm just keep a mental note to keep an eye out for a third herb. Wailed. Okay, inventory. First aid. Those can go into the cupboard. I wanted to check my scarf. Got a wool scarf versus scarf. Cottons. Eh. Gonna go with wool is better than cotton.
hoodie is Gives us two percent protection, wind chill, arid. See what it looks like fully repaired. We need three ratio teeth. Harvest. Uh, hoodie. Point five. Not bad. Ten percent waterproofing though, and. Wincho resistance. That's torn it. Well, the only thing I've found so far is running shoes, so I've been scrapping those for leather to keep my boots going. Um, okay, so actually it doesn't really do anything for you will tear that up. Pretty, pretty repaired. The wing kit is a hoot, old one. Put the herbs in there. Artix in there. Wing killers. Purification tablets. There they can go in there. I think. Keep the rest of everything on. Accidentally put my boots in there. Good. I need boots. Yeah, it was a mistake. Double clicked the wrong thing. Right. Now we on the we've got quite a lot of stuff on us. Okay. Pretty equipped there. Herbal tea can go having it again.
Hey. I think snow if the hypothermia wouldn't kill me. Badger? Badger. Go drink the badger. Sounds like a blizzard outside, so that's, you know, fun. Oh, now I can take stuff out of the fridge. Didn't I do it that before? Okay, I'm thinking that's gonna be me for the day. That's a six hour stream. Been going for six hours. That's. We'll continue this tomorrow. See where it leads us. So, yeah. It's been an interesting game so far. I've enjoyed it. We've got a lot of scavenging to do and a lot of storying to get through. But we shall tomorrow. Thank you all for coming and watching and donating and enjoying and everything else and chatting and spending some time with us. It is, as always, very much appreciated. I'll see you all later. Have a good one.